I am Sister Charlotte, St. Joseph Bar Children's Home, Nine Manama. I am in charge of the children in this home. Last year, 2019, January, I was given this duty. And when I came here and I found, I was not able to do the carry on this duty. I have been with children so long as a religious, as a religious sister from the beginning of my religious life. I have been with the children in the schools, in the boarding houses, but here I found I was not able to face them. I could not uh, understand them, the way they reacted and how they behaved. I found very difficult to face them and to do the work as the mistress, as the in charge of these children. And actually I want to go away, I want to give up this duty. But I remember uh, Reverend Priyanta, General Secretary of Bible Society, because I have met about some time ago, and he has given me his uh, contact number. I remembered him and I contacted him and I asked him whether he can come and help my children. And it was a very happy uh, event, I would say. And he accepted it very, uh, with, I do not know how to say thank you. With this group, he came last May. For three days he was with us. And there were, and there were four animators, Father Lester Jayasuriya and other three teachers. I felt these animators were full of God's love. And these four groups of my children were with them for three days. And they had many activities. The, these children took part very earnestly. They were very happy to be with these animators and took part in every activity. And also I felt they were reading the Word of God and I am very thankful to the Bible Society. They provided, they gave each child a single Bible and they were very happy to have that Bible. And uh, they were reading and they were sharing. I felt something was going on even those three days. They were very attached to their animators. And I think they shared. I felt they were not normal children, meaning they have faced each one in different way, some sad event or negative experiences they must have had. And that must have been uh, making them not free to be real children. So that's the point I felt that these uh, animators were able to bring out all that negative things from the children. I think it helped them very much. I can say that definitely there was a change had taken place because gradually throughout this year it happened. This uh, program was conducted in 2019, May 17, 18, and 19. Not remember exactly. Anyway, in May, so now in July 2020, after one year, gradually these children have changed a lot. Among themselves, 
I feel we have become real sisters. The ordinary way, once in a way, there are little things, but now they accept each other and they talk to each other very uh, cordially. And there is joy. I feel that they have become fully changed through God's self and especially the word of God has helped them. And they love to pray. I can see they come to the chapel and read the Bible. And also the way they react to me, uh, not like those days now. Now they are really loving children, I can say. And uh, I would say some children were really, like I didn't know whether I could do anything with them. They were nasty. Mean, uh, one child was simply hurting herself and making uh, uh, wounds on her hand. And there was a big wound when I came here. But after this session, she became quiet. She used to argue and uh, also all the time used to shout and talk and fight also with others. And we could not uh, actually control her. <coughs> Once it happened, when uh, they were carrying some firewood, she purposely went and got hurt on her eye and we had to hospitalize her. And even the nurses and the doctors were frightened and they thought that we have hurt her that way. But now she has changed so much. I would say she has become really, really the disciple of Jesus and very kind and loving. Even this morning when I said something, she ran and came and helped me to do that work with love and joy. So I am very much thankful this pro for this program, those who are conducting, especially to the Bible Society, uh, Reverend Priyanta, who is in charge of these programs and conducting. I am really grateful because even now today you have come uh, to help us and to be with the children and children are, I can see they are enjoying, they are happy to meet this group because they have gained a lot. Throughout this COVID-19 period, after they got school holidays March 12, from that day to, till today, no one went home. They are not bothered of going home also. They are very happy. I think it is this self. They have got, they have got love to Jesus and also love to their uh, love of reading the Bible. And through the word of God, they have touched Jesus. And for all this, this group, the healing the hearts of trauma has helped them very much. So I would say big thank you, big thank you. I am sure these children's life in future will be uh, that your joy because your expectation is that to help the weak and the suffering and you have helped very much and it is not over. I think they will uh, bloom in the world very happily and they will make others also happy. So God bless you.